While there's no evidence that compiled Dart code runs faster than the speed of light, Dart is a very fast language. But did you know that as of Dart 3.8, it's also become a lot easier to write, too? First, as of Dart 3.6, we added digit separators, an optional syntax to visually separate chunks of big long numbers. Add an underscore anywhere you're used to seeing a comma or period to increase the readability of large constants. Next, with the arrival of wildcard variables in Dart 3.7, you can start throwing data in the garbage with reckless abandon. Henceforth, a single underscore has a special semantic meaning. It's non-binding and can even be used multiple times in an expression to consume everything you don't care about. If a variable doesn't spark joy, wildcard it. After that, we've got null-aware elements, available today in Dart 3.8, which are elements that are, uh, aware of whether or not they're null. Seems like a pretty good name. You can use null-aware elements when declaring any collection to only include them if they are not null. Before, you would have had to use Dart's conditional syntax to check whether the element was null. Now, a single question mark before the variable name handles everything. Plus, I think they look cute. Kind of like an NPC with a quest in a video game. Now, if you thought Dart was cooking before, wait until you run Flutter Upgrade and taste the new menu available in Dart 3.8.